KYC number 10, brand safety. Your channel may be YPP suspended, kicked out of your network, demonetized, and preventing you from joining any network if your channel is not brand safe. Now, there are many reasons a channel can get demonetized, uploading other people's videos without permission, getting copyright strikes, doing things like tag stuffing or other bad acting that we talked about in previous episodes of KYC. But today, let's focus on brand safety and answer your question, is your channel brand safe? To keep your channel safe so you don't get YPP suspended or terminated. Let's go. What about Lil Fluffy behind me? This is a girl gamer. I think this is the first one that we've reviewed on The George Show, haven't we? So she's a live streamer and she's a fan of The Sims. Let me show you one of her live streams. Roll it. <laughs> okay, A for rhyming skills. Don't procrastinate, boys. Ma you know. But this is not brand safe, guys. And I think her channel is very good. I think the channel will do quite well. And I think her live streams will be very popular on Twitch because of her spunky attitude. Uh, I'm sure there are other words you could use to describe her. But do I think this channel will get YPP suspended because of using words like that in videos? No. I think this channel may have videos that get demonetized where those videos that have that strong language would be uh, not suitable for most advertisers. But I think her channel is mostly good content and with clean language. So I would consider the channel brand safe except the live stream videos where she has strong language would not be appropriate for monetization. The links to all these channels are down there in the description below if you want to check out any of these creators and have a look at more of their content. Here is Jarvis Davis behind me. Let's have a look at his channel and it turns out he's live streaming right now. Let's check out his Lamborghini Huracan live stream. Okay, so first problem is description here. Jarvis, why don't you describe your live streams so people coming here uh, will have an idea of what they're watching. Lamborghini Huracan, it's gameplay. You are doing clickbait. In your channel, you said... Oh, I guess the live stream just ended. <laughs> anyway, there was a picture of a Lamborghini that didn't look like gameplay, so that's clickbait. We shouldn't do that. Is this channel brand safe? Let's have a look. The channel uses has a lot of videos that are reaction videos. Let me play one of them for you. Roll it! See the problem there, guys? He's playing the entire music video. He's not adding any commentary during the video. He's just showing his face. This is called framing. There's no difference. What if he just played the whole music video and had some animated background computer graphics. Would that be okay? This is not fair use, guys. The boundary between fair use and copyright infringement is quite simple. Is someone able to watch this entire video and then not watch the original work? Does this video replace the original work? If so, don't do it. This is grounds for strikes if the owner of this video feels like giving you a strike. This is not brand safe, guys. If you're gonna do reaction videos, do it like a movie review. Show short clips, talk about it, give your opinion. This type of video, in my opinion, is completely bad. How about Hypnotic Channel behind me? Is that brand safe? This channel features music, and it is not brand safe because on the about page, oh wow, we got a monkey. Has this happened to you? YouTube is feeding the monkeys today. Show me the about page, please. Pretty please. There we go. <laughs> Hypnotic is based in Stuttgart, Germany. Great, that's fine. The problem is right here. If you are an artist, record label, and wish for your track to be removed, please let us know by contacting the email above. What does that say? No copyright intended. I'm uploading videos and music because I feel like it. I know I don't have permission, but if you are the rights holder of a piece of music I've uploaded without permission, 
please take the time to go to my about page, read my message, asking you to email me. Guys, rights holders will never read your about page or your video description saying, no copyright intended, just let me know and I'll remove anything. They'll just give you a strike or monetize your video. They're gonna use the YouTube tools to enforce their rights. They're not gonna read your metadata. This is bad and this is also not brand safe because brands don't want to advertise on a channel that's clearly using someone else's content without permission because then the brand is associating their public image with this channel's public image. Would Coca-Cola want to be associated with channels that upload videos or music without permission? No! So don't do this. How about Danny DeBaum? Is he brand safe? Well, take a look. Blowjob on Omega. Logan Paul on Omega. Now that's clickbait. I've already watched the video. He saw a guy with a Logan Paul like picture who wasn't Logan Paul. Hot sisters, nice booty. Okay, clearly this is not brand safe. Why? <laughs> because it's sexual, because it is not all ages. And YouTube is meant to be an all ages platform and of course encourages brands that are also of that nature. Yes, there's places on the internet for adult content. They're called porn sites. They also have a certain kind of advertiser who wants to be on a porn site. This is not the advertisers that YouTube wants. So if you want to be brand safe, if you want to keep your channel safe, don't go to a Omegle. Don't show uh, boobies on your channel. And guys, this is just YouTube's rules. If you want to make videos like this, find a platform that appreciates this kind of content and upload there. If you're uploading this kind of content to YouTube and you get a YPP suspension, you will never be able to join any network or monetize any videos until YouTube retracts that suspension. It's not like a, oh, we'll just wait 30 days and the suspension will go away. It's not like when you get a strike and in 90 days that strike expires. This literally will stay with you and you will not be able to use the YouTube platform to make money or join a network because this is not fixable. I mean, I guess you can delete the videos and then reapply. Maybe that is fixable, but a better solution is just don't do it in the first place. And if you really want to, find another platform that encourages it. How about Stir Top TV, which I think is meant to be straight to the top TV, STR. What's wrong with this channel? Well, let's play a few videos. These look like gameplay videos to me. Loading. That seems fine. Now this channel is not brand safe and why? <laughs> he has the download links to the APKs for these games that he's showing on his channel. Let me show you. So here's a bit.ly link and he's also got the mega upload link, but let's go to the bit.ly link, translate that page. I think this is in Thai. Download this game, download all three links, apps that require it. Clearly piracy. Is that brand safe guys? Actually, is that even safe on YouTube in any form or fashion? No, <laughs> it's not. Never show download links to commercial products circumventing paying for something. Do you like this KYC series to keep your channel safe? If so, click that I to see the playlist of all of the videos in case you missed any. You may think brand safety, that's something else I have to worry about every time I upload a video and go through my channel to make sure it's not gonna get YPP suspended. <clears throat> in addition to no tag stuffing, uploading videos with permission and all those other rules, yes. Remember guys, this is YouTube's platform and brand safety is top of mind in all of YouTube so that they don't repeat a moment of what happened last year in 2017 where big brands pulled all of their budgets away from YouTube because of this issue. People were uploading unsafe videos for brands and the media was dramatizing it, perhaps sensationalizing it. And that's what YouTube does not want to happen for a single moment in 2018. Their two, two primary goals are to grow, yes, but to grow responsibly and 
content quality, where content quality is here and growing is here in terms of priority. So brand safety, content quality, that's what we need to all focus on this year. And that's why this series exists, to help teach you what we have learned after reviewing thousands of channels and freedom, and I do mean thousands and thousands, and I'll keep making these videos as long as you keep telling me you find them helpful. If so, tell me down there in the comments below because I do read all the comments and I decide what to make next on The George Show based on those comments. Remember our mission, guys. We want to help each other grow together as a family and we want to create careers for all of you in this digital world. Really, roll it. big part of making a career on YouTube is following all the rules and knowing that YouTube's customer are brands. So of course you need to follow the things that brands look for. Not just what you think will build your audience. Don't risk losing everything you've built on your channel because you're stubborn and you're not following the rules. And then YouTube one day suspends your channel from YPP or terminates you. All I can say is I told you so. So use platforms that appreciate that kind of content and use YouTube for what it appreciates. What is the fastest way to grow on YouTube, guys? You might say clickbait or showing boobies or <laughs> it's collaboration. Collaboration with other people where you feature each other in your videos, encourage your subscriber bases to discover your collaborators' channels. Collaboration is the fastest way to grow on YouTube and it's the healthiest way as well. That's what I encourage all of you to do. What do you think are also great tips on how to grow faster on YouTube? Share them down there in the comments below. And for those of you who have been watching The George Show for a long time, you might be getting tired of these, let's all help each other grow together by sharing our best practices in the comments below tips. But do it anyway. <laughs> There's a lot of new viewers and those people will read your comments and probably check your channel out if you've left a meaningful comment. That's another great way to grow on YouTube. Be active and thoughtful. Reply to people in comments. They will probably go look you up if they're interested in what you had to write. So keep safe, do good things to grow your channel, and leave good comments to help each other grow together as a family. Who am I? I am Papa George, George Sunpai, Obi-Wan George Nobi, many other names you, the beautiful Freedom Family, has given me. I am George, CEO and founder of Freedom for Freedom and the Freedom Family. And everything else we're going to do in Dubai, in game dev, in crypto, and in music, those are our four pillars, if you didn't know. We're focused on YouTube, as we've always been for five years now. We're five years old, guys, as an MCN. Well, almost. We're focused on music with Music Factory. Click that I to see the Music Factory channel, where you can download 100% safe music. Well, you can listen to the music that you can download that is 100% safe. Why? Because we own it outright, and it's our policy and my guarantee that we will never issue a strike or take down on any videos using Music Factory Music, even if you leave Freedom. Of course, you may use it and keep 100% of the revenue as long as you're a Freedom partner, but if you leave Freedom, only new videos you upload using Music Factory may get a monetization claim, which we will use to pay the artist who made the music. But all your videos that you used Music Factory Music with while partnered with Freedom will never have that happen to them. Hope this helps. So music, <laughs> crypto, we're doing the crypto miner. We've built a tool that helps you make money while you sleep. Click that I to learn more about the crypto miner and download it. And you can use that to make money mining crypto with your computer, which we pay you each month, just like we pay you your YouTube revenue. We launched it on February 20th, which is the same day, 2018, that YouTube unlinked all the small channels that had less than 1,000 subscribers and less than 4,000 hours of watch time in the last 12 months. What I call the 4K, 1K rule. That's a mouthful. 
why made the shorter term. And we launched the crypto miner to help recover that lost revenue. As long as you have a reasonably modern GPU, you could make five to a hundred dollars a month uh, from just running crypto miner. And our third pillar, our fourth pillar, is game dev. And that is about Dave Brachia, the studio head of MGN Studios, the game development division of Freedom. And you can click that eye to meet Dave. That's his introduction video. He will make a follow-up video soon, talking about all the progress we've made and the games you'll be able to play and design together with us, because that's our primary goal, is to create games that you can play and contribute to with level designers, assets, voice acting, graphics. So we have YouTube, music, crypto, game dev as our four pillars. What do you think of those guys? Which one is your favorite? Which one are you most looking forward to? Tell me down there in the comments below. I would love to know. In the meantime, I'm George and you've been watching. Click that eye to partner with Freedom and join the Freedom family so we can all grow together. You get many perks like position music, you also get epidemic sound, a lot of other access to royalty free videos, sponsorships, and many things to help you grow. Just click the links down there in the description below to get involved in our community, our forums, our Discord chat servers, meet our graphics team, meet our community team, all of that on Discord and the forums. What are you waiting for? Get started. And we will grow together as a family because this is the Freedom Family. You are part of it, we are all part of it, and we're all growing together. To get more George, click that big F. That will subscribe you to Freedom Central, home of The George Show. And PewDiePie gave one of you, Freedom Family, a big shout out. Click that video to see the shout out and to see our new 3D sets for you. And click that video to see what YouTube recommends you watch next.